Hello, Classroom 4A. Welcome to class meeting on this Tuesday afternoon, April 19th, 2022. I'm going to use Starfall to start our meeting today. A motion song. Our letter this week is letter O. So I chose the song Wheels on the Bus. On starts with the letter O. Wheels on the Bus. Next, I'll use Starfall for our calendar activity, so I'll move over to the April calendar. Yippee! It's April 2022. Let's make a calendar. First, we'll start with the days of the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So what day of the week is it today? Well, today is Tuesday. Great job. Today is Tuesday, April 19th, 2022. And if today is Tuesday, then yesterday was Monday. And if today is Tuesday, what will tomorrow be? Well, tomorrow will be Wednesday. That's right, Wednesday. So today is Tuesday, April 19th, 2022. So I'll pick up the day of the week. Tuesday. And the date. 19th. Great job. Next, we'll mark the special days this month. Month Well, Friday, April 1st, we celebrated April Fool's Day. And Sunday, April 3rd, Ramadan begins. And then on Friday, April 15th, Good Friday. And Saturday, April 16th, Passover. The 16th was also a birthday from our class. One of our young men turned 18. 
And then on Sunday, April 17th, we celebrated Easter. And today is Tuesday, April 19th, so I'll pick up the smiley face and move it over to today's date. And then this week on Friday, April 22nd, we'll celebrate Earth Day. Next, I'll choose a picture to decorate our calendar, and I'm going to choose the planets in honor of Earth Day. We also have another birthday this month on Wednesday, April 27th. 27th. She'll be celebrating her 16th birthday. Now our April 2022 calendar is complete. Next, I'll use Starfall Goodbye. for our letter activity. So I'll move up to the ABC rhymes. And let's see what picture they have for letter O. An ostrich. Ostrich starts with the letter O. Ah, ostrich. Olive Ostrich went out one day, stuck her head in the sand, and stayed that way. Ah, Ostrich. Oh. Octagon Otter Olive Octopus Ostrich Next, I'll read two articles from news to you the unique learning system. The first article, the title is Lyrid Meteor Shower. This came out in World News today, April 19th. And here's a picture of a meteor shower over the Earth. The Lyrid Meteor Shower peaks April 22nd through the 23rd. A meteor shower is a group of meteors. Meteors look like bright stars with long tails. Meteors move quickly across the sky. People may see many meteors in the sky during a meteor shower. The best time to see meteors is at night, before the moon rises. People do not need telescopes to see meteors. People can go to dark areas outside away from any lights. They can just look up at the sky. People may see 10 to 15 meteors per hour during the Lyrid meteor shower. Would you like to see the Lyrid meteor shower? Oh, I would. Here's the article, same article. This time we have pictures with the words. Lyrid meteor shower. People can see the Lyrid meteor shower April 22nd through the 23rd. A meteor shower is a group of meteors. Meteors look like bright stars with long tails. Meteors move quickly across the sky. People may see many meteors during a meteor shower. The best time to see meteors is at night. People do not need telescopes to see meteors. People can go to dark areas outside. They can just look up at the sky. Would you like to see the Lyrid meteor shower? Now for our review questions. Number one, what moves quickly across the sky? Moons, meteors, or planets? Well, meteors move quickly across the sky. Number two, what do meteors look like? Flowers, clouds, or stars? Well, meteors look like stars. And number three, when is the best time to see a meteor in the morning, at night, or in the afternoon? Well, the best time to see a meteor is at night. 
Next, I'll read an article that also came out in World News today, April 19th. This article is called Gorilla's 65th Birthday, and here is a picture of a western lowland gorilla. A gorilla celebrated its 65th birthday on April 13th. The gorilla is a western lowland gorilla named Fatou. Fatou lives at the Berlin Zoo in Berlin, Germany. Germany is a country in Western Europe. People think Fatou is the oldest gorilla in the world. Gorillas in zoos usually live to be 50 years old. Zookeepers gave special treats to Fatou for her birthday. The treats included a cake. The cake was a rice cake decorated with berries and fruit. Fatou has lived at the Berlin Zoo since 1959. The Berlin Zoo believes she was about two years old when she came to the zoo. Happy birthday, Fatou! Here we have the same article. This time we have pictures with the words, Gorilla's 65th birthday. A gorilla celebrated its 65th birthday on April 13th. The gorilla is named Fatou. Fatou lives at the Berlin Zoo in Berlin, Germany. Germany is a country in Western Europe. People think Fatou is the oldest gorilla in the world. Zookeepers gave special treats to Fatou. The treats included a cake. The cake was decorated with berries and fruits. Fatou has lived at the Berlin Zoo since 1959. Happy birthday, Fatou. Now for our review questions. Number one, what is Fatou? A giraffe, a gorilla, or a tiger? Well, Fatou is a gorilla. Number two, what did Fatou celebrate on April 13th? Graduation, a new home, or her birthday? Well, Fatou celebrated her birthday on April 13th. And number three, where does Fatou live? In Berlin, Germany, Sydney, Australia, or Santiago, Chile? Well, Fatou lives in Berlin, Germany. Wouldn't that be fun to go visit her? Well, thank you for joining my class meeting today on this Tuesday, April 19th, 2022. I hope you enjoyed our Backpack Bear ABC rhyme from Starfall for the letter O this week with the ostrich and our two articles from News to You, the unique learning system that came out today, April 19th. Lyrid meteor shower that's going to be happening this weekend and the gorilla's 65th birthday. Happy birthday, Fatu. I hope you're remembering to wash your hands often throughout the day for at least 20 seconds and wear your mask where you still need to when you're out in the community to stay safe. I hope you have a wonderful evening and I look forward to you joining my next YouTube class meeting. Take care. Bye.